Greetings viewers, today's video is about yet another Lenovo laptop, the E14. Let's have a look. Let us start by having a look at the stats of the model in hand. This model comes with the 10th generation Intel Core i5 U-series CPU clocked at 1.6 GHz with maximum turbo frequency of 4.2 GHz. 8 GB of DDR4 RAM clocked at 2666 MHz. A 14-inch 1920x1080 anti-glare IPS display a 256 GB M.2 solid state disk has integrated Intel UHD graphics, a 720p built in webcam, a fingerprint reader, which also doubles as the power button, a gigabit Ethernet, 802.11 AC Wi Fi, Bluetooth 5.0, and runs on Windows 10 Professional 64 bit operating system. Even though a ThinkPad, this model does not come with the soft-to-the-touch plastic lid. Instead, it has a plain and smooth plastic lid, which is not a big deal for most people, but perhaps a group of select hardcore ThinkPad enthusiasts. The hinges on this E14, much like the E51s, allow the screen to open up to 180 degrees, be that a good or a bad thing. This laptop weighs around 1.7 kilograms or 3.7 pounds, and that is 200 grams or half a pound lighter than the E15. When it comes to ports, the E14 is well equipped. Starting from the left side of the chassis, there is a single USB-C port capable of power delivery, followed by two 3.1 USB-A ports, a single 1.4 HDMI port and a 3.5mm headphone jack. Not much to report about the front of the chassis, nice and clean. Going to the right side of the chassis, there is a single USB-A port and the Ethernet port. A Kensington lock socket is there as well, for those who wish to secure their laptops in their workplace. The rear of the chassis, much like the front, has nothing exciting going on. Looking at the belly of the beast, there are two vividly visible speaker holes on each side. They both house a speaker, giving the E14 crisp stereo sound. Let's talk keyboard. Very typical Lenovo feeling. The keys have a soft, quiet and very pleasant tactile feedback. Typing on this keyboard is not going to be tiresome. As great as this keyboard may be, it lacks in the backlight department. At least the model I'm playing around with. Again, may not be a big deal to some, but a deal breaker for others. The 215 nit full high definition IPS display is very well calibrated out of the box. Natural colors and great visibility angles. And no, this one does not come with a privacy screen. So what is the verdict for this little laptop? I would say the E14 holds its ground firmly. There are a couple of things that are amiss compared to the bigger E15 model, um, such as the backlit keyboard, at least in the model that I have in hand. But that is in no way a deal breaker, at least for me. And that is it for this one. Thank you so much for watching, if you have been. If you enjoyed this video, please do not hesitate to click the like and subscribe buttons. I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Bye.